This is Turtle Tracks Travels with Gary and Denise. Join us as we tackle the Sleaford Tawana Track in Lincoln National Park in South Australia. We've come to do this Sleaford to one hour track. It says it's about 14 k's, but um, reading on it, people say it's about 20 really, with all the diversions and roundabouts. Not straight line, yeah. is it? Uh, it looks good though, doesn't it? It sounds good. Apparently, it's got some of the best sand dune experiences on the Air Peninsula. So, this should, could be quite good. And apparently, you can take anything from an hour doing it to all day, depending if you do all the extra lookouts yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Okay, just go and do it. Let's go. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's go. I suppose we've had a um, load of time actually. We're going to do this track, aren't we? Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't, we don't want the embarrassment of getting stuck, even though it could still happen. Ah, Always happen. All part of the fun. Yeah, of course it is. You could get stuck sometimes, just have fun and get yourself out. So, um, we'll lower the tyre pressure down. So, on the back with the canopy, obviously on the sand, I do 20 psi. And the front 18. If we need to go low, we will, but it seemed to be okay the other day. So uh, we'll try that, shall we? Yeah, sounds good. Let's do it. Don't take. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you blowing, blowing the air? Just keep my air, 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 air out. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't take long to do anyway, does it? <laughs> Oi! <laughs> this ain't that sort of channel. Oh, no, not right. <laughs> Oh, I've got it all wrong, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> now, um, Gary's now doing it this way with just that thing from ALB because he used to rig everything up and I used to say, you don't need all this rigged up because we're not putting air in. And then he's no, realised no. the actual, just that gadget it's from ARB is brilliant. Uh, our old one wasn't as good, so you had to connect it all up to get an accurate reading, but this, yeah. this one is brilliant. Yeah, that little one you wind on, yeah. it's just a pain in there. It was a pain, so th this, is, this is really good. Cool. Someone order a Chinese? Ch chicken chow mein. Chicken chow mein? Yeah. Get in. at the uh, sand dunes there and then we've come round to the lake we're um, a bit squeaky at the moment we're thinking that when we get to ARB that we need the um, leaf springs re-greasing and stuff. We did try, well Gary. We did try yesterday. Did try squeezing some in, but it's a bit hard when you haven't got a hoist and stuff. Lifting it out, we did lift it out, didn't we? But yeah. Still squeezing like a bugger. So, right? it's been a good, I mean, what, we've been away a good six, seven months since, seven, eight months since we had done. So we're probably due, with all the dusty road conditions and now sand, we probably will need doing. Right, so we come out onto um, just a little bit of a rocky track, nothing too major. Ah, it's easy, isn't it? Now, now if you're a long-suffering wife like myself, you quite often, being married is like having a 12-year-old. You have to pull over for them to have a wee. <laughs> so um, I'll point the camera obviously the other way, but it gives me the chance just to have a little look I can't get any further because it's a bit bushy, but look at the colour of that water. He's finished now, so that's a distraction. <laughs> I was in um, four low for the sand dune, but um, now we've got on the track here, I'll just put it back into four high. It seems to be absolutely fine. 
Um, obviously, you can always put it back into uh, poor life. We get loads of sand dunes again for this bit, really. Um, four hides enough. It's absolutely fine, isn't it? Yeah. Feels, feels good. Okay, well this looks like it's the start of the uh, June system and we did read online that the it's red markers, so just follow those. And we've just gone back into four low. Yeah. Because it's going to be sand. <laughs> you just changed it, haven't you, Gaz? I've just changed it and I've got to change yeah. it back. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind, at least we're, at least we're ready. Yeah, so if you do get stuck, you're already in the right setting. Can you bring the mirrors in? Yeah, that's a good idea. We bring our, I'll press the power button and it's going to go. Zzzz. Zzzz. Is it done? It took about two seconds. Yeah. I mean, you could probably do lots of four high, but um, yeah. it's best just to be in it four low. Very narrow track coming through. This is when you fingers crossed that no one comes the other way. Yeah, we've got, got the radio on, haven't we? Yeah, well, we put it on, most people seem to be on channel 40 when you're on the road, but we did look up that four wheel driver, you should be in on 18. But I did a radio check and couldn't hear anyone on there, so we see how we go and have a look, see if anyone talks. Gonna change my profession, camera girl. No, I know. Pop yourself in. I'll be working for um, the BBC next week. A bit rocky this bit. Alright. But you just gotta take it slow. Yeah. Get your pinstripes as well. Yeah. It didn't go into dunes as we thought, so uh, it's gone back into Fort High. Yeah, you can yeah. always change it if we suddenly hit a sand dune. Yeah, that's right. You can just change it back, can't you? It's pretty easy, isn't it? It's just yeah. rocky and a bit slow. And... Yeah, it's more rocky at the moment. Yeah. Oh. oh, here we go. Here's oh, here change. we go. We might be changing it again now. <laughs> that's the beauty of four wheel driving. You, you can't just leave it in one setting and for the whole time. Most of the time, you've got to keep changing to the conditions. <laughs> oh, oh, you feel like you're going to tip the truck. That, that just felt really weird. <laughs> I'm a wimp and I admit it. Yeah, and you know it. And I know it. Oh, just look at the scenery. We're going along the track. There's the sea just there. And a bit of a tilt. That's it, take the time. It's scary. We're not sure if this is Salmon Hole or um, going down to Tina Beach. Level up. How'd you feel, guys? 
Yeah, all right. Just get loads of scratches on the <laughs> vehicle. Oh well. Oh. Got to use it. Yeah. So it's four, isn't it? on the map that says it's the salmon ponds. It looks quite nice, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks gorgeous. So it's got there's actually a couple of people fishing over there. So we're reversing back, another attempt at this one. So, gonna be a bit hard enough. No, well there was that rock to avoid, weren't there? Yay! Did it that time! <laughs> Gotta get a bit of welly. Yeah. Just getting used uh, to it, isn't it? Yeah. Well, at least, we're, at least we're honest, you, you're not always gonna make it that first time. And especially when you've not done any of this sort of dunes before. No, we just got to uh, rethink it sometimes. Yeah. You just got to get, have another go and give it a bit of welly. Yeah, that's it. Bit of right foot. Yeah. Well, this is awesome. This brings you out to Tina Beach. Look at that. We have been told that the sand could be quite boggy, so uh, obviously check the tides and don't go too close. <laughs> oh well, I suppose we could always check the test out the match track so we get stuck. An awesome spot to do some sandboarding if you've got some boards and there's a load of kids up there all coming down we forgot to buy some we was gonna go and see if we could get a couple of cheapies in Kmart but oh well never mind we'll have to get some for next time oh look here they come <laughs> great fun markers are very far and few between but as it's a popular track you can see where everybody else is driven so if it is dead quiet and all this has been blown over you might find it difficult to see it wouldn't take a lot, in this it wouldn't take a lot. so you just got to keep an eye out all the time maybe bring some binoculars so you can check when the next one is I suppose some of it is obvious you're just following the coastline in, in saying that, we just got lost. 
go forward a little bit more because there is some tracks here so we can see the marker I think over that way oh, yeah, there's okay. a load of tracks. Yeah. yeah. So you just gotta sometimes slow down, stop, have a look, and think, well, I know it's following the coastline there, so I'm not gonna be driving further into the dune and, get, and getting lost. Oh, no. You you're changing your settings again. I'm just gonna try and fall high. Fall high, yeah, go for it. We got all the recovery gear known to man and never used any of it, so if we get stuck and got to use something. Yeah, it's in, uh, just going to go back in for high for a second. For high? For, for low, sorry. Oh, for low. I'll just try for high now, I'm going to get down the flat ground. See how it reacts? Yeah. Now you've been driving on sand dunes, have you noticed this um, thing that the wheel alignment is out by 50 mils either side? That you, do you feel the need to have track correction? No. <laughs> don't we, feel it at all. It's the biggest myth going. You don't need it. We think it's all a load of BS, basically. Good marketing to get everybody to pay thousands to have this, uh, this, oh, no, so this no. correction. So we don't think you need it. It's all a load of mm. <laughs> Bu bully ball. Oh. Bit of a um, mark right there, isn't it? Gone narrow again and a bit bumpy. Yeah, we'll have to swap. Maybe we'll find somewhere. To have cool. lunch because yeah, it's now on. quarter past one and my tummy's rumbling. Yeah. Terence is just absolutely famished. Yeah, he looks it. He's wasting away there. We'll um after oh, after lunch be my turn. Uh, let's have a look on the map. This is just going to bring us down to the Sleaford lookout, which oh yeah, oh, yeah. over there. Hopefully it's not too windy. Yeah, I think and, um, it's gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, we can have some lunch with that cracking view. That's right. And of course, coffee. Yeah, we'll have nice coffee. With the best view, sea view. Oh, this is awesome. What a good fun this is. Oh. Okay, so we've stopped at the Sleaford lookout. And there is emus over there. <laughs> Oh, look at them. Love them. Hello, emus. The emus are probably a little bit too far away, but hopefully uh, when we look at the footage later, you can see them. Oh, what do you think of the lookout, guys? Oh, it's terrific, isn't it? Look at the views. Look at the colours. Cool. Look at the sand against the, you know, the gold sand dunes. It's, it's so blue. What's that song? Blue is the colour. <laughs> <laughs> I had a girlfriend and she is so blue. Okay, I suppose we better make some lunch then. I've just done some crackers and wrap and to make it easier, I'm not using any plates. I'm just done it on the chopping board. Got any mayonnaise? Uh, oh, it's but, in the caravan fridge. No, it's in the caravan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sure you'll be all right. I'm sure you can cope. See how much I suffer? You just don't realise. Suffering. Right to go for it. You're suffering, aren't you? Mm. Look where you are. Look where you are, suffering. Uh, every day. What, living with me? <laughs> Look at that. Absolutely lovely, isn't it? Oh. Quite beautiful. It's my turn. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out. Lisa's about.
What do you reckon, little niece? Good? Woohoo! Yeah, <laughs> it's brilliant! <laughs> Good the, fun, isn't it? The sea, the, going over the sand dunes, the scenery. Oh, it's just fantastic. Brilliant. Yeah, Absolutely really brilliant. good. Ah, oh, there they go. <coughs> just cut, just a few wallabies. See on the hill. Probably getting a bit frightened now. Another little side track. Miller Hole. It don't matter which one you take, they're all stunning. They're all the same view, really. They're all beautiful. It's the right time of the year, you'll see the whales. Oh, here comes a big whale. <laughs> hey! Love it, ain't you? <laughs> Good fun, isn't it? Yeah, brilliant. Now you've got to make a decision. You can go down there, but I don't know what the tide's doing. It looks like the tide's in. Look. So you might have to go on this track here and go around this bit. Yeah. We'll do that. Yeah, that's, that's what it looks like. I don't know. That's all right, further down. We'll have a look. Have a look at the concentration, the it's smile good. on her I face. Like, oh, oh. Turning one way, then I'm turning the, the next. next. Oh, it just don't stop for you, does it? Oh. All this forward driving. It just doesn't stop. Look at this, turns left there, do you see? Left, left, left. Left, 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 left. Oh, I don't know if we need to change. Well, well, you might need to get soft now. Oh. If I was you, I'd back up. And then go into the low. Yep. Just so you're in the right gear. Mm -hmm. That's good. Okay, so I've changed it into four low, because we're going to go into this fluffy stuff. Yeah. Hopefully I won't get stuck. Go on, Fluffster. Give it another go. <laughs> back you go, give it another go. Put it in Have reverse. I got to go all the way back? Yeah, go back. Because you won't be able to pull away on this hill. Mm. They're reversing back and doing what they're doing. Well done, little Nisa, well done! Woohoo, I've done it! Done it that time. <laughs> <laughs> Bit more welly. That was brilliant, little Nisa. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear you again. <laughs> can you? Oh, it was awesome, wasn't it? Good fun. I can hear you. Right, where do we go from here? Are we doing this big hill or not? Give it a go. go can we go up the top of the hill? Yeah, go up there and have a look. Right. Roll back down and have another go. Oh bummer, I can't make it up that hill. I had about three goes, but Gary done it. It was sod. I can see this coming like a competition. I better go there, find him. What do you think, Nice? Oh, brilliant. Enjoying it? Yeah, brilliant, absolutely fantastic. We stopped, we got talking to these couple of lads, nice lads, and they said, yeah, team up with them. So we thought, oh, we might as well. Yeah. Down across the old dunes. Yeah. It's pretty easy though, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's brilliant. 
Ah, look at it. It's mum and two babies, emus there, look. Aww. How beautiful is that? Lovely. Lovely, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> We've pulled over in our little convoy because someone's got stuck, so we're going to give them a hand. Should be cool. You can stay in the car, that's alright. Yeah. These are the guys we stopped to help out. Hopefully that they'll be out in a minute and we can be all on our way. At least we got to use the next tracks. I don't know. I don't even know they got in four-wheel drive. I don't know. Yeah, keep going! Yay! Why you keep going, Johnny? <laughs> Don't stop. <laughs> <laughs> now we've all stopped in the fluffy stuff. We've got to try and get out. Yeah, he's off. Sinking, go back. Don't hit his ranger. No, you're spinning. Yeah. Do you want to use the max tracks? Do you want to use their... Well done, guess. Use the max tracks out. Yay. That's it. Well, that was a good amount. Use them. <laughs> you only got two down, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. I said he'd probably be straight out, but the blank yeah. would be the shame. Yep. He's kept going. Oh. No. Oh, he's going to do it. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. So Gaz is putting the Max tracks back. Are you happy now you use them, Gaz? Yeah. It's all part of the fun, isn't it? Yeah. It's all good, isn't it? It is if you can get them on there. Just, uh, too much crap on the roof. Yeah. Oh well, you'll have a sort out. Well, that was all great fun. We've come to the end of that track, and now these lads, they said about this other track, Mc McLaren, I think mm. they said, track. And it leads out to this lovely cove, so we're going to... Don't speak, Matthew. He can't nuts. talk, he's, he's eating. Um, so we thought, sod it, we'll follow them and check it out. We would have missed this turn off, so it's a good job we're following these lads. What did you say, Gus? It's all part of the fun. Oh, sure is. We got a great big convoy. Trucking through the night. We got a great, great big, big convoy. Ain't she a beautiful sight? <laughs> 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 so, yeah, well, there's three of us anyway. Um, this track is just like this apparently all the way, just a little bit rocky in places, nothing too major. It's easy, isn't it? So, um, hopefully it does lead out to this gorgeous cove.
<coughs> so we've come out to McLaren Point and um, there's a campground so we're just heading towards that. Slowly but surely. Yep. <coughs> it's pretty easy isn't it? Yeah. Just got to take your time. It was a little bit windy that side, so we're going to go over to the other side now. <laughs> Look at this, come up trumps again. Engine point. A few steps, you're on the beach. Oh, there's a new you. Wow, this is such a lovely camp spot. You just have to make sure you've got a signal, go online, and you have to book it with the South Australian National Parks site and you need a vehicle permit as well but I mean just look at our spot over there it's just absolutely brilliant she sees your cup empty you're about to get out your chair give her the old finger fuck you're better than that Jacob wow this is priceless glass of bubbles with a strawberry about a few I don't know 20 steps and here I am, sun's going down. And there we are, just there, <laughs> brilliant. And there's the guys that we uh, teamed up with today, cracking lads. <laughs> I'm here. Oh, oh we've come up trumps again, Gaz, haven't we? Yeah. Cheers. Only got a winged it. Mm. Always happens, isn't it? Best camp spots in the world ever. We left the caravan back at the other place, swagging it tonight. Turn the truck up on the hill. Yep. There she is, up there. We'll set the swag up soon. Yep. In the meantime, we've got a sunset to watch. Oh, look at that. It's terrible, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> Beer and wine. You have got bubbles, look. I know. Sunset o'clock. <coughs> so you rolling it? Mm. None of this rough stuff. I'm <laughs> swagging it. I ain't drinking tins of beer. Nah. Ah. Bubbles and strawberries for me. That's where we slept last night. There's our swag. Beautiful. <laughs> so uh, got the luxury of a caravan, but no, we had to sleep out in our swag last night. Great fun. Right, we just got up. Uh, we just packed all our gear up and drove over to uh, September Beach. Uh, we're in the day use area, we thought, oh right, we'll come have a look at the beach, might yeah. do a bit of paddle boarding. Do some brekkie here. Yeah. Do some brekkie, getting a bit hungry now, aren't we? Yeah, get the bacon and eggs on. Let's do it. Let's have a look. Oh, look at that. It's terrible. And of course it's packed out. Ramoed. Ramoed. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Oh, stunning. What a dump. I suppose we better go and do some breakfast now then. Yeah, and I think we'll be going for a swim. Yeah. 
Definitely. Good, it? Let's do it then. Come. Let's do it. What are you doing, Nice. Oh, look at this. Bacon, mushrooms. We got avocado, tomatoes to go on in a minute. I thought I'd give Gary a morning off. Sort of, you cut out the mushrooms. <laughs> Bloody cheek, isn't it? And you're cutting the avocado. Yeah, and I'm doing the avocado. Look, I'm just ready. I've got my knife there. I'm just better do it. You're you're doing all the technical stuff. That's it. Hey, and what else am I doing? I'm multitasking. So I've done the mushrooms. I'm doing the avocado. And what else am I doing? The coffee. coffee. Got a little kettle going. Two cups. Hey, you're living the dream. Oh, absolutely living, living the dream. The dream. The beach is just there. Yeah, you slept in your swag last night. Yep. New Year's Day. Living it. Isn't you? Yeah. Jammy little bugger, you are. Living the high life. There you go, you jammy little bugger. Nice. Nice, nice. cup of coffee. Nice. Oh, it's nice and nice. Yeah. You're blinded. Blinded nice. by the light. Nice coffee. Coffee. That's posh. Oh, is it? How's the breath you doing? It's coming along nicely. It is, isn't it? Yeah, look at that. There's the water. So the um the health kick is going well then. Yeah. No, it's not too bad. The worst bit's obviously the bacon, tomatoes, mushrooms, avo. Ain't too bad. No, this Egg, is healthy. Eggs are good for you. Yeah, when they go on in a minute. Ooh, flies. Love a few flies, isn't it? Well, see if you can do it without cracking them and breaking them everywhere. And of course, I can. I'm, like a, I'm, I did. I'm an expert. Pro. Look at that. Who's the poacher this morning? I can't fit everything on this. <laughs> you're pushing your luck. That's what you're doing. I know. Yeah, I can always use this. To batter you. <laughs> yeah, looks right. That's good. We're going to enjoy it in a minute, aren't we? Oh, nice. Look at the concentration on her face, look. It'd be perfect. Look at that. Breakfast fit for a king. You finally redeemed yourself after all these years. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, oh smashing. Yeah. That's what you want. Should we hold this knife? Yeah. We left you have one of those in the cabin. Yeah, we? we did. Lovely. Look at this. You got breakfast, bacon and eggs, mm. coffee, right by the ocean. Sea view. And a sea view. Does it get much better than this? Nah. Nah. It doesn't. In life, it's what life's all about. Awesome, isn't it? Oh, fantastic. Okay.